Hello, I am uh, Davian Canty, and I'm going to present my ethical hacking um, uh, individual video project. Uh, what I'm going to do basically is um, show you how some Windows users are uh, constantly getting uh, malware, um, adware, uh, pop ups. Basically, um, I've been fixing computers. Now I have a home business where I, I, I uh, fix Windows 7 installations and um, this video basically is to try to show Windows users how to not get these viruses. So I'm going to start by uh, showing you how to avoid, avoid unwanted changes on your computer. So here we're going to open up Internet Explorer. So as you see here, we have um, Search conduit, which is a, a, a big thing I, I, I see with most um, uh, people that um, have issues. Search conduit is not uh, the ideal search engine we want to use. So um, we're going to go and change this to Google. And while we're here, we'll see uh, where this the home page is. Basically, uh, we want to change that. See what most some software that you download, let's say you want to download a new version of Flash, you might encounter something that wants to change your home page, which is very, very normal of companies to want to change home pages. So you have to make sure that when you do install software, it does not make any unwanted changes on your computer. So we're going to change and go back to home. So now we are going to, for instance, let's say we want to install, um, update your search engine, no thanks. Let's say we want to install um, Google Chrome. So we're going to go to, um, actually we're just, we're going to go to a, a a uh, very popular download website that has software, free software of use, and a simple installation of, of something that you might want might come with something that you don't want. And that's the purpose of Another thing I notice or that users should notice is when you download, there tends to be a habit of multiple download links. For instance, you see here we have, here we have a a start download link, which is not real. Oh, uh, there's several. See here, this is download faster, download manager. Let's talk about download managers. Number one, there is no such thing as a download manager if you did not install it on your computer. Uh, some users uh, are tricked into downloading software and the, the software is, is masked as software that you want and through getting through getting you that software to offer to have a download manager, which which itself you can download and it will itself give you malware and probably won't give you the program at all that you need. So if we go. We're now going to try to change the default installation settings on Windows so go to this tab security here and privacy see like we have pop-up blocker on um, see another something that that might bother some users might not um, 
is to do not collect data for use by in private filtering. So that's one way to help you secure your computer. Um, also, um, setting the cookies to uh, too high will also also um, stop you from a lot of uh, tracking cookies or or computers. Um, Put cookies on your computer that track your activity, and this activity is used to, to, can't harm you, but just don't want it. Next. Installing a toolbar. The next thing I'm going to show is how the default Windows installation does not come with any antivirus, which this is the default installation. There's nothing really running here. So what I'm going to do is after I'm done fixing each computer, what I do is I install a free version of security software called AVG, which offers free personal use of their software. But in this download, I will show an example of unwanted software that might come with it. See, one thing I notice, I get a lot of questions after I'm done um, giving new computers, and let's say someone needs to install Flash. What I get a lot of questions are, what should I do when I come to Express install or Custom install? See, Express install is always recommended, but what comes with Express install is probably some Express programs, uh, Express toolbars. Now, AVG is known to be kind of light on the toolbar side. It doesn't really give you um, too many issues. But um, let's see the difference between Express and Custom here. It asks you the destination folder and personal email scanner. All of these are part of the AVG software. But for instance, if we Go install Flash. I would say Flash is almost guaranteed. To come with some, some extra, see, Optional offer, I might click no, but I'll still get another question later on. Um, another issue I noticed is a lot of security threats with uh, Internet Explorer, or not many, a lot of, not really a lot of security threats. There are more secure browsers out there, and I, this is one of the, another one of the top questions that I get. Um, what should your internet browser be? Now, the reason Firefox is better than Internet Explorer is because it's team is is mostly non I'm not sure non-profit so 
They really care about the software. And aside from that, or to conclude, we want to say that many ways to get viruses from sometimes installing simple toolbars. I didn't show any actual viruses that would pop up, but the idea of the message is to know that you are the user in control of your computer. So uh, there's no such thing as a download manager. Uh, unless you want one, unless you have physically installed one, uh, no, nothing should be managing your downloads. Uh, nothing should be changing your 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 home page, and uh, nothing should be uh, changing your in, any of your settings on your computer that you don't want. Don't be afraid to click on uh, the the custom settings for uh, when you install programs. Because you are the user, even if you're not that good with computers, you know, just take a time, take time and try to read through. Don't just click next, next, next until the end. Because I, I've heard people tell me that, and well, that's why I have to fix your computers. So uh, this is the end of my video. I hope you've learned something. Thank you.